morning. And we've been hard at work, our team has, to be able to release a new beta feature for teachers to easily be able to share the lesson slides with students. So let me model for you how to do it as a teacher. And then what we'll do is we'll take a look at what students see when you share lesson slides with them. So I'm going to go down here and I'm going to pick a lesson that would probably be springtime for me as a former middle school teacher. So I'm going to pick this lesson right here, a dividing nation. And we're going to go to the lesson guides page. Now, notice one of the things that has been added to the complete lesson guide for both the English and the Spanish version is this ability to be able to share with students. Now, remember, this is a beta feature. Uh, if you click this right here, you'll get a pop up on the screen. It'll say, are you sure that you want to be able to share the slides? Yes, and I do. And what that means then is the student would be able to get that complete lesson guide. Now, I've got a student account logged in over here and we're going to go down to that lesson uh, that I was at, Dividing Nation. We're going to go inside there and I'm going to click over here in the sidebar. You'll see now that the student has something underneath program content that says lesson slides. And there it is. There's the complete lesson guide that they can go through. Now, you may, as a teacher, decide, you know what? I do not want them to have the complete lesson guide because remember, the complete lesson guide is going to have some slides, especially at the beginning, that are really meant for you in terms of preparation. So like the video that we detail what the activity is like, our lesson cycle, and materials pages. So um, you may decide that you want to edit this complete lesson guide uh, to eliminate some of that stuff. So let's say I wanted to hide slide two, slide three, and slide four, and then slide five because that one's a preparation slide. And since slide six and slide one are similar to one another, I'm going to go ahead and uh, hide that one as well. So now let's say that those are the only ones that I want hidden in my custom slideshow. Remember, you can also edit the text on these. Uh, so that's something else that you can do. But let's say that I'm all done and I want to be able to share this one. First, I need to give it a name. So I'm going to call this one my distance learning lesson slides for dividing nation. All right. So now I click save. And once it's done saving, go back, follow the breadcrumbs back to your lesson guides page. And once you've done that, there's your complete or there, there is your modified lesson guide that we've made. And you'll see that I do have this button right there to be able to share with students. Now, I did share that other one. So you can see it with the purple button right there. If I want to unshare it, then I just unclick that one. So I want to unshare the complete lesson guide. And then I want to share this one right here. Perfect. So I've done that. Now let's uh, let's go back to uh, an incognito and log in as uh, that student account once more and see uh, if uh, if everything is good to go. All right. So I think it was uh, U.S. No industrialism, and we're going to go down to that chapter, dividing nation. There we go. And remember, over here on the side, we're going to click lesson slides. That's what the student's going to click, and there it is. So I open up the distance learning one and all that other stuff should be gone. Excellent. See how easy that is. So we think that that's a great tool. Really appreciate teachers encouraging us to be able to get that out to you quickly. Remember, it's in beta form. So uh, get in there, kick the tires. If you run into any problems, please make sure that you reach out to us. Um, very easy to be able to do that. Remember, a um, couple of different places. One is within your subscription. Go up to your name in the upper right hand corner. Go to help and you'll see a place on that page where you can get uh, product feedback or you can just simply email us at info, I-N-F-O, at teachtci.com. Thank you guys so much. Mm -hmm.